So straight from WeatherTech is my new uh, hood visor protector. And we're gonna install that on my Ram here. This uh, should work for any 2019 and up new body style Ram pickup truck, 1500. 2500 is probably similar, same with the 3500. This WeatherTech one is pretty easy to install. Let's get started. So the instructions say it kind of mounted in place, just like this. And then to use something like a grease pencil, to go through and mark which ones of these fasteners you're gonna have to remove. So that's gonna be just like this one. The camera obviously can't see this, but I'm just marking the fasteners through the holes. And then they want you to remove the visor. Now I'm not gonna show myself removing every single one of these. But I will say that these nylon pry tools are some of the best cheap automotive tools that you can get. Now they do include new ones to install. They know that you're gonna break these. Interestingly, these are Phillips screws that are going to be put in there. So I wanna show you guys something. You are gonna to wanna to put it in place properly first so these flanges from the protector go underneath the rubber parts of the seal. And it's gonna be kind of difficult to do, but I started over here, got this one in, just kind of lined it up. And then the rest of these I lined up as well. I don't know if the camera can see that, but the holes are lined up here with the hood. And you basically just want to get each flange under it as you go one at a time, and then kind of start forcing it back as you start getting it closer and closer. Then once those holes line up, you just grab one of these. And one thing to keep in mind is you are not gonna start the threads on this. What you're gonna have to end up doing is installing the little pin here and then forcing that screw up inside. So just like this. Make sure it's up and into the hole and just grab your screwdriver. You can try and get those threads to start, but they most likely will not. So what you're gonna have to do is just kind of give it a lot of force. This one's actually started, the other ones did not. Same thing for over here. Make sure that hole is lined up. apply pressure. I'll finish this off for the last couple fasteners. And of course, don't forget to install these little bump stickers here. And I think I'll put one right down in here. This is just in case the uh, visor here impacts the hood for whatever reason. So just make sure you guys install these. So now we can close the hood and we may have to mess with the bump stops a little bit. But I think we're gonna be okay. Yeah, we don't even have to adjust the hood stops. to adjust this a little bit there we go definitely make sure that you have the seal in correctly looks good let's try it now perfect 
really doesn't look too bad. I'm happy with that. Hope you guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for more.